I like alcohol, in certain situations, within certain limitations, and always in moderation. I especially enjoy the absolute family of vodkas, tasty, powerful, and refined enough to drink straight up. On the other hand, I'm shocked by the prevalence of drunk driving. Driving is serious business. Drunk driving is a gamble, a misuse of alcohol, an abuse of the driving privilege, and a breach of one's primary commitment to society not to put the innocent in jeopardy. I decided to create a piece of artwork to express my feelings on impaired driving. This bi-level assemblage contains various elements. Starting with the upper level, this glass head, illuminated by a rotating light, represents the brain at a 0.08 blood alcohol content, broadcasting to all within its sphere of influence that it is incapable of focus. This comically large volume of liquor represents overindulgence. The dice displaying snake eyes, frozen in solid acrylic, are a surrogate for ice cubes and represent the gamble of intoxication. And the skull is a surrogate for a martini olive and represents death from bad choices. The miniature traffic light hanging off a bent pole represents losing control of your vehicle, causing, in this case, only property damage. This geometric formation of absolute bottles was chosen as much for its visual impact as it was for its meaning. As the focal point for this assemblage, the bottles serve to represent alcohol, not to indict it. The bowling pin-like formation could be seen as the obstacle that the overindulger must metaphorically knock down to overcome. This element is self-explanatory. The upper level is supported by champagne corks. The martini glass and bottle formation are illuminated with these actual stoplights mounted on the lower level. Their intense red light represents danger. A die-cast car and Lego motorcycle are included, and you can imagine that either the driver or the rider could be the impaired perpetrator, with the other being the victim. Due to their orientation on the track, they're headed on a collision course. And this demonstrates that you never know what's around the bend. One final detail. This particular bottle is Absolute's homage to Andy Warhol, who had created a print ad for Absolute in the 1980s. May they take their brand's inclusion in this project in the spirit in which it was intended.